Greetings YouTubers, Cthulhu back with you again, this time with another retro, i.e. I found it laying around, it's an old figure, but I'm going to make a video for it. Transformers review, this time of Transformers Animated Optimus Prime. Um, pretty cool little figure, you know a lot of people gave Animated a lot of crap, just because of the way it looked. Um, it did take a little bit of getting used to it as a Transformers fan, I'll admit that, but once you kind of warmed up to it, um, short of Transformers Prime, it's probably one of my m favorite series of Transformers. But here he is in his fire truck mode, his little water squirter, which you could actually, I think, fill up with water. I might have took the little bulb off of it. Oh, no, that's it. It's been a while since I messed with this guy. Uh, basically, you put it in water and you would soak it up like that, I think. Not a lot, mind you, and then just spooge it out there. And he also has his battle axe on here. Which you can just fold out. <clears throat> kind of just get that set now out of the way. Transformation. It's actually been a little while, so bear with me. Um, let's see here. Get this out of the way, possibly. Yep. Uh, take the front bumper, separate it, fold it back down and around. This may and is probably horribly out of order from what may or may not be on instructions. Uh, he has this kind of auto thing. If I might have broke mine, I can't remember. He put, pull a little tab on his back. And it's supposed to release his legs to kind of spin down and around. And mine isn't doing it at the moment. There it goes. Well, basically, you'd release it and it would kind of, there it goes, spin down into place. Now you pretty much have his legs and just separate them. Flip his feet up. Fold the, the bottom back tire in. Flip the headlight back there so it just, everything just kind of rests on each other here. I, I really like the animated figures mostly because, um, you know, once I warmed up to them, they did a great job of keeping that, you know, in the figure form, that maquette look that the show had. But, you know, it doesn't, I don't know, it just kind of comes across as looking real well. Um, then, let's see here. Flip that up. There's his head. You can go ahead and, like, very front panel here flips open. Kind of unlocks his arms. It's kind of very G1 ish. Flip it out. His hands just kind of flip out from inside there. Which I don't have any fingernails. Of the, there we go. And then the black part just kind of tabs on there to hold it in place. Same thing over here. Then you just flip his head up. The lights just kind of flip all the way back down and rest there. And there you have Transformers Animated Optimus Prime. Um, one minor gripe about the show and in general character design. I'm not a big fan. I guess just because I'm that old school of Optimus Prime having a mouth. But luckily, this has a feature, has a little lever here on the back. You can flip up his mask. And there you go. But yeah, pretty nice little figure. Like I said, it keeps that uh, kind of maquette look that the show had. But doesn't like compromise the figure to get that look. You know, like, like the jet figure is really nice. I, I think I had a couple. I just had no idea where they got to. I actually was just cleaning up and found this guy. But anyway, you can attach his gun in any either hand you so choose. Same with his axe. <clears throat> Excuse me, it's had like an allergy attack a minute ago. Whoops. And he has battle damage. One side falls off. Um, but anyway, pretty basic figure by some Transformer standards. 
But there he is, Transformers Animated, Optimus Prime. Uh, this will be the last kind of retro Transformers review for a while. Uh, hopefully coming soon to my local stores will be the new Thundercats toys, which I will definitely be getting and doing videos for. Uh, and then hopefully uh, work schedule permitting and me not being so tired I don't feel like doing it. Uh, we'll start a Lego week tomorrow with some Legos I've been picking up. And since I finally finished building it, I will show you the um, robot mode, as it were, of the Creo Bumblebee. So stay tuned and till next time.